YouTube, Hayes here with a new video. It's been a long time, but I'm finally back. And this time I'm showing off this new software that I just caught and that just came out. It is by Native Instruments and Evolution Series, Vocal Colors Bronte. And this thing sounds amazing. And I wanted to show it to you all. So when you purchase this uh, pack, it's called the World Colors. And it comes with other instruments, which all sound really good. But I bought this specifically just for Bronte's voice. So I have I have this loaded up in, in Contact, and I think you need the full version of Contact. So I will confirm that for you and put that in the description. But for now, let's listen to it. Oh, it gives me chills just using this. Um, so I'm going to explain in this video how to use this software as well as show you guys a demonstration of how I would use this in a song. So let's just get right to this. Uh, so here in this main interface, um, you have this right here, uh, which you can choose uh, like either a key switch or your modulation wheel to change um, the certain sounds that you're using. And this is really nice because you can click these to also change which sounds you are using. Uh, so for example, right here, if I change it to band ha up, and if I change this to a short soft ha, and you see these numbers right here. Uh, those numbers are the values in which the velocity or modulation wheel or any other MIDI signal changes which sound you're playing. It's set to velocity, so if you, you know, just press that note very soft, huh. gives me a low, short, ha, soft. And if I press it hard with a swell, ooh, <laughs> uh, moving on, you have these slots, which I think it's for these right here um and these are for your uh, key switches or your other presets i believe this 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 determines the key switch um c1 down here uh you can either do poly or legato so if it's in poly ha. or if it's in legato ha. 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 you can only press one you can also move it up or down, semi tones or octaves, attack, release. So you, you can have a slower entrance or a longer uh, release of the sound. Expression and dynamics for you know volumes and vibrato if if this even has vibrato and some reverb. So I'm just going to run through some of the presets here. So it's a combination of shorts. And I'm going to change the expression to my modulation wheel. Oops, I accidentally removed it. And there we go. <sighs> okay, sustained. Ah, oh. okay. This is probably one of the mo one of my favorite software that I got recently. Uh, 
They've also recorded Bronte with some uh, ad-libs in different keys. these ad-libs I typically like to use it in legato just so that the the it doesn't really like conflict um and you have some other swells for uh stereo movement Let me know if you'd like a more in-depth video on this where I run through uh, more of the presets and more of the sounds um, and how I would also use this software in particular uh, because what I like to do is set this expression to my modulation wheel because I don't have a expre separate expression slider. Um, I also like to set this to a, the mod modulation wheel as well so that I can get a mix of this uh, expression and sounds. Yeah, and thank you everybody for sticking through to the end of the video. And now I'm going to show you how I would use this Vocal Colors Bronte in a song. I'm going to mute my mic and please enjoy. I'm Hayes, and thanks for watching.